Sushi is probably the most well-known Japanese food. An export hit with worldwide success. Available in all price classes, an evening in an upmarket sushi restaurant can come at $400 or more per person, just for the sushi. On the other side of the spectrum are kaiten sushi or running sushi restaurants. With prices often starting as low as 110 yen per plate, these kind of restaurants offer affordable sushi experiences for the average Japanese family. Today we will visit one of them and at the end of the video not only will you know how I spent my Sunday afternoons, but also how to navigate these restaurants with their fancy computers and plate swallowing machines by yourself. When entering the restaurant, you often have to pick a number and wait. You can select to sit at a table or at the counter, enter the number of people you are with and then wait. You can reserve online as well, then you'll be able to bypass most of the queue. We got a table. It looks like this. It's next to the conveyor belts and the separators give you some level of privacy. At the table, first things first. Get the case with the matcha green tea powder and fill your cup with one or two of these tiny spoons. Then pour in hot water from the tap attached below the conveyor belt. Careful, it's hot. Once this basic setup is done, take a look at the conveyor belts. At the bottom is a selection of the restaurant's menu items. Use it to get inspiration or grab something to start eating immediately. At the top is the sushi highway. What you can see passing by at close to warp speed here are custom orders that are transported directly to the table. How do you place custom orders? Of course by talking to a waiter. No, just kidding. That's way too mundane. You are ordering from this touch screen. If you're not familiar with Japanese, that's no problem. It can be switched to English as well. When it comes to sushi, I never look at the rolls but go directly to the nigiri. These are the ones where there's a piece of fish on top of rice and that's it. No seaweed or rolling involved. I often start off with a grilled cheese salmon, then maybe some scallop and onion covered salmon or tuna. Before starting to eat, grab some of the pickled ginger to cleanse your palate. Then enjoy. If, after some time, you want to get something different or you're just not that into raw fish, Worry not, you can order a lot more than just sushi in these kind of restaurants. How about battered and fried prawns? A nice bowl of ramen. Yes, this one also arrived on the conveyor belt. Or some fried chicken for your kids or yourself. You can also order drinks on the touchscreen, such as beer or juice, as in this case. Once you've finished your plates, you can stack them up at your table or slide them into this opening. If you've put in 5 plates, a game will start on the screen. There's a gacha machine on top of the conveyor belt and if you're lucky, you will win one of the capsules. Oh no! Not this time. Let's have some more food and then see how we will do at 10 plates. Oh well, not my lucky day, but definitely at 15. You can't always win. Sometimes a man has to recognize defeat and carry on. For example, with a dessert. Currently, this chain has a matcha green tea parfait special. Looks pretty good, but they make only 20 per day. Let's see if I'm lucky this time. Yes, it's still available. Fruits, red anko beans, matcha ice cream, matcha cream and matcha jelly. I know it comes as a surprise now, I like matcha. Then let's round this off with some macaron mango parfait. I really like this one. A small piece of macaron, a little bit of mango sauce and a very nice and light cream. All for 180 yen plus tax. Once you're done, call for the bill. On the touchscreen of course. Someone will come and confirm how much you've consumed. Then get the clipboard with your table number and proceed to the checkout. And then you are done. An everyday Japanese conveyable sushi experience. In case you're wondering, we average between 3300 yen or about $30 and 4000 yen or about $36 US for the three of us. Of course I need to pay for this out of my own pocket, but if you want to support me with some virtual love, please consider liking this video. 
And if you want to go totally crazy, subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching and see you next time.